Welcome. In front of me is a Motorola G50 and today I will show you how to capture a screenshot on this phone. And to get started, simply open up the content that you wish to capture. I'll be using settings as an example for this. And once you have that content open and visible on screen, hold power key and volume down at the same time. You'll get this image right here. You also get a sound to it, but I have it muted so we can't really hear anything. Now obviously you could see there are a couple options visible next to that screenshot, so I'm gonna do that once again. And you can see we have uh, edit, uh, tag and delete along with oops, along with the scrollable options. I'm gonna go back to it once again and tap on it. And as you can see it just scrolls down and you get to press stop to uh, stop it from obnoxiously scrolling down in a way too fast pace. Now when it comes down to scrolling or scrollable screenshots like that, uh, this is obviously the worst and absolute garbage way you can possibly implement this. And just a way to kind of solve the problem that this stupid method creates, uh, what I advise you to do is overshoot whatever it is that you're trying to uh, capture. I mean, it's not like you really have a choice, to be honest. And from there, just edit the photo by cropping it to the point that you wanted it to go down to. So obviously, if as an example, you want to go from settings or this is again the settings as an example, if I would want to create that scrollable screenshot all the way down to, let's say, accessibility right here. I'm going to do that once again and just kind of demonstrate it. So you overshoot it. It's right here, I believe. Yep, accessibility. Uh, so I overshot it by two points. And from there, I can just go back to photos application. And it's right. Is that this one? No, no. Okay, now we go there. We have accessibility. And from here, I can simply edit it. And oh, we got a crop right there. And I can just shorten it to a point that I wanted it to be at. Like I mentioned, this is the stupidest way you can do it. Uh, other brands, uh, even in a worse way, do it way better than this one. Uh, assuming they do it because some phones don't actually have scrollable screenshots uh, because the way I'm the reason why I'm saying this is the, the worst way it adds additional work for you to do for no uh, no reason really because you do have to edit it if it overshot it and if it didn't overshot it that means that it didn't capture far enough if you went over then you need to crop it so yeah but obviously you can see that there we have all the screenshots that I have captured uh, right here and yeah that's basically how you would do it and how you deal with scrollable screenshots and just fixing up the uh, Motorola mess that they created here so anyway if you found this video helpful don't forget to hit like subscribe and thanks for watching